the stuff in Iceland is pretty special. It's a stunning place and uh, there's huge big action scenes there and it's volcanic rock and snow capped mountains. It's just that was such a beautiful place. You've had various roles where you have to go up and down uh, it's easier to put the weight on than it is to take it off. Taking it off is uh, a pretty moody existence. You know, you're underfed and overtrained, and, and that's what I'm doing now is losing the weight. So, but it's uh, it's worse than something. How is it working with you? Right, yeah, she's fantastic. And especially coming back the second time and uh, having a relationship and, and getting straight into it, having a short hand with the characters. So, it's, it's great. And how is it different the second time around with Madeline coming back on set? It's different this time. Well, you just have a familiarity, you know. You don't spend the first month getting to know one another. You know, we we able to dive straight into it. And she has such a great sense of humour, and, and uh, this is everyone on that set. You know, it's, it's such a, it's a great group of people. You like your Thor body or your Rush body? <laughs> Both of them were extremes, you know, Rush was on my normal way and this was over and so both of them take a lot of work. Um, that's the first summer in the middle. And then do you think it's time for a female-centric superhero movie? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, what about Hunger Games? I mean, it's just kind of a superhero. I was actually really excited to go to London because I've never been and I always wanted to go. It was great to reunite with the cast and see everyone again and see everyone with their babies and just, you know, talk about life and catch up. It's always awesome. It seems like a real familiar type of set, right? Everybody's just kind of friends. Oh yeah, everybody's buds. I mean, I've known like I've known Zach since I was like 15 years old. She used to be about forever. And um, yeah, I just new friends, becoming old friends, and I've known Natalie for years. And I just want to know how big in reality is Chris Hemsworth. You know what? He's a tall, slim, attractive, athletic man. <laughs> and I'm not complaining, but he looks, he bulked up a lot to play for. So he looks much bigger when he's got the cape and he's got all the um, it, it is pretty difficult, like, because we film nine months out of the year at this uh, So it is, that, that's a little bit of a squeeze. There's that three month period at the end. Uh, and then there are, like, sporadic hiatus weeks in between, which is how we film uh, this film. Um, I would do, like, three weeks in LA, fly to London, fly to London, do a week in London, come home, and then, like, run back and forth for six months. Oh, yeah, so we're like,